Today, I'm going to introduce our proximity sensor and show you how to get text alerts when you've forgotten to close your garage door. I developed the proximity sensor because I was constantly forgetting to close my garage door at night and was worried that I'd be a target for a theft or a home invasion. It was also annoying to have neighbors or police knock on my front door late at night warning me that my garage door was left open. Because of the way a garage door moves, I knew that traditional limit switches would not work. Unlike limit switches, a proximity sensor has no moving parts. Instead, it uses an invisible beam of light to tell you if an object is close or not. It works by detecting the reflections from objects or surfaces up to one meter away. The range depends on the size and reflectivity of the object. Because it uses modulated and filtered light, it is insensitive to visible light, even direct sunlight. We've come up with a cool design. The case is transparent, 3D printed, environmentally friendly PLA. An internal LED lights up when no object is detected, and it sort of looks like a cool cat eye. It will mount to any service with double-sided mounting tape. You can also optionally mount it to one of our garage door brackets. It has a simple three-wire interface, and you can use it with a Veggie Hub and post data to a website server like Veggie Cloud. If you use Veggie Cloud, you can get text and email alerts when the door is left open between specified times. I've configured Veggie Cloud to send me a text and email message if the garage door is left open past 6 p.m. at night. During the day, I often want it open so Veggie Cloud blocks any messages until night. Since I've installed mine, I've never once forgotten to close the garage door at night and sleep better knowing that my house and family are safe. Thanks for watching. Check out other cool products and video tutorials at vegetronics.com.